every organization today started with just one idea and if you'll have same people with same background same education same brought up there will be no diversity of ideas given the challenges we face the best solutions will only be formed if we have the best minds who have different perspectives gender diversity is not a zero sum game it is not where a man requires to lose for a woman to gain the more diversity gender diversity you have in an organization i think the push or or or, or the ability to change into a sustainable organization will be faster wherever you have women in the leading positions those companies flourish you may still take away the same decision at the end of the day in the boardroom right but it makes a difference when people are engaged and have a discussion there's no single point of view where everyone is following dissent actually creates knowledge it creates discussion discussion means again better information you're better informed i'll be the first one to admit that our diversity gender diversity numbers right now are nothing to write home about we've been trying to do diversity for n number of years and frankly speaking we had not succeeded we're an industrial conglomerate we operate plants in remote locations where it's very difficult for us to uh, you know uh, increase the gender diversity but we're not using that as an excuse anymore just enough to have a diverse group of people it's clearly important to include them in your conversations to have that engagement and to have that holistic perspective we started this journey a couple of years back so what we what we thought that we need to really look at what are the key issues 12% of engineering graduates are women and out of the 12 we can only tap a very minuscule percentage an intelligent population sitting and home and not being made part of the work stream anybody who can do the job should get the opportunity so the biasness in gender has to go let the best person be taken on board but at least have an open door policy and look at it in an, with an equal lens they want to go and work on towers they want to go and work in uh, for, on on in tunnels they want to work on machines they don't want any discrimination there the idea is not that you create reverse discrimination positive discrimination all these things because then you're tainting it as well ke bhai ladki hai raat ka waqt hai shift pe na bulao ya plant pe nahi bhejo ya sales ke liye market mein nahi they don't want to be treated that way absolutely not when people will feel genuinely included then the change will happen we launched the first trade apprentice program for women uh and and this is now bringing women into a hardcore industrial blue collar environment they will go out in sweltering heat in in port kasim do maintenance on pipelines on valves on jetties we're making sure that they provided all the facilities we are you know doing whatever we can to encourage women to come and work even at the plant sites and mashallah they are progressing they are excelling and they are very well accepted by the organization their colleagues their managers their supervisor i think that engro is a very open environment it's a very nurturing environment right now for women so for me diversity inclusion and now moved on to equity as well so e is also added with d and i so if equality is our objective to achieve so equity becomes means to achieve that one of the markers that we've set for ourselves is that by 2025 30% of our leadership team has to be has to comprise of 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 women which is which is a very audacious goal you know we're taking tiny steps right first excom member we have three women on the board which is fantastic we need more we need more at all levels entry level and senior level so the idea is to promote uh, the you know uh, women workers from within within the teams uh, so that they can get to the leadership position it's it's a more long term sort of thinking as opposed to saying well i can't hire a woman board member because there aren't any create i see a huge potential moving forward in organizations like ours 
should take a lead on it. My aspiration is that we become one of the best organizations in Pakistan to work for as a diverse organization. Yes, there are a lot of issues, there are a lot of constraints, but the heart is in the right place, the will is there, and they're trying to do that. So for all these young women out there, you know, they should really go out and, and explore these, you know, especially with Engro. I think it's, it's a great environment for them to, you know, nurture and grow.